Hi, everyone. Um, welcome to this Chalk Talk on employee perks and benefits. This is a listing of the perks and benefits that are offered to you as employees of Cerdoni, and it's updated as of this month. Um, just a little background information. I mean, this these are the types of services and, and perks that we, we review from time to time um, as part of our strategic goal of enhancing the employee experience. We do have a committee that meets four times a year and um, we review these things and try to offer new perks and incentives um, in our attempt to stay current and competitive and just to allow for our employees to have that that experience here at Cerdoni. So I know Jen had shared the sheet with everybody within the invitation, but I will go through it one by one. Um, if anyone has any questions, we can save them to the end. But one thing I wanted to know was everything that's in red on this sheet, there's actual, there's a policy within the handbook that um, explains it better and in more detail. So, um, I encourage you to review the handbook for more information on these particular items. So we grouped everything in different buckets. So we have insurance and compensation, we have benefits, we have education and perks. Um, so some of the more familiar um, items that everybody um, kind of knows about or maybe doesn't know all about. So we have our medical insurance which is an employer and employee cost share. That's with Geisinger. We have the HMO plan and the PPO plan. Um, one of the benefits we offer with this is not only do we cover employees, but we cover employees, families, spouses, children, which we're finding out more and more. A lot of companies don't do that anymore. So um, that's certainly still a perk that we honor here. Um, healthy rewards is part of our plan. So for those of you who are signed up for fitness clubs, at, um, and activities for children. There is an actual program at Geisinger. They will refund you with proof of payment for these services, up to $100 per individual and $200 per family. That information can be found on our intranet. And also involved with our medical insurance, which some plans don't cover, is an eye exam, which is covered once per plan year. This is in addition to your vision coverage on your vision plan. Um, for those of you who are contact lens wearers, I strongly suggest that if you go for an eye exam, you use your eye exam under your health plan because this way it frees up your allowance for contacts on your vision plan. So it kind of stretches your dollar a little better. Yeah, Maria. And then don't they have to, like when you, because I know when I went for my eye exam, you have to tell them before they you bill do. it that yes. you're using your Geisinger. Yes. So they take that $100 first and then bill. the eye Exactly. Exam. Yeah. You have to tell them because they'll automatically go, especially if you're a longstanding patient, they'll, they'll go right to your vision coverage, but you want to make sure that you tell them that you have an eye exam coverage under uh, Geisinger and have them bill it that way. Thanks, Noreen. Yeah, that's a good point. Dental insurance is with Sun Life Dental. Um, again, we cover both employees and their families. Um, that's an employee-employee cost share. Um, the nice thing about our dental insurance plan is there is no deductible. It seems like more and more plans that are being offered by employers, you have to satisfy a deductible first. But we've been able to secure these rates with these with dental and vision for the last few years and um, they haven't raised them and the coverage is, is pretty pretty competitive. Vision insurance, that is 100% employee paid. Um, but again, it is pretty nominal and you get up to $160 in benefits for contact lenses. You get your eye exam, you get um, lenses every so often. I think lenses are every 12 months, frames might be every 24 months. Um, but all of that information was shared during our, our open enrollment plan. And, and when you join with the company, we update that information every year. Another benefit we have with our insurance is Creative Benefits and their ESR team. So Creative Benefits is our insurance broker for our medical, dental, vision, and life insurance plans. So if you have a problem with your billing for Geisinger, for uh, Sun Life, 
for VBA. You can call them. Um, they have extended hours. A lot of those employees have worked with the insurance companies before, so they know how to get the answers to your problems. They, they're your first step, really, before you start calling Geisinger to, or Sun Life or the vision plan to figure out your billing issues, have questions, and, and they'll help you with that. We also offer AFLAC, which is a supplemental insurance program that's completely employee paid. They have numerous types of coverages. Um, basically what you get from AFLAC, the benefit for being signing up under Cerdoni is we'll take a payroll deduction on those plans for you. So it alleviates you having to pay attention to paying those bills. But once you sign up for these plans, those rates continue going forward. So a lot of insurances sometimes are based on your age or your experience ratings and how much you've used the plan. These, once you're locked in, you're locked in for life. So these are portable even when you leave that um, you continue with those rates. Open enrollment for all of these plans are at different times. So AFLAC is going to be toward the end of this year. Um, medical, dental, and vision is in May because the plan year starts June 1st. Um, we also offer a short-term disability plan, which is 100% employer paid. So this covers you for lengthy illnesses over five days. Um, you must use five days of PTO first, but um, basically this will cover you up to 180 days in various increments. So your first 60 days is 100%, your next 60 days is 80%, and your last 60 days is 60% but it's a way to bridge you if you have a serious operation, if you've um, broken something, if, um, you know, just if, if you need medical attention and you have to be out of work, this is what it kicks in. Um, and then through Mutual of Omaha, we have our life, long-term disability and accidental death and dismemberment coverage for our employees. So, your life insurance is covered at one and a half times your salary. That is 100% paid by Sordoni. So if God forbid anything ever happened to you, your beneficiaries would be listed and be paid out at one and a half times your salary. Long-term disability kicks in after you've satisfied your short-term disability. And that's for obviously a much more extended, probably permanent disabling condition if something should happen to you. An accidental death and dismemberment is basically what it is, it's accident insurance, or if you lose a limb or something like that, there are coverages through, through Cerdoni. Um, also on this plan is an employee assistance program. This is counseling services for, for mental health, for legal matters, for financial counseling. Um, there's information about that as well that gets sent out to their, I think they're located somewhere in, in um, the Midwest, so they're, they're not, you won't be speaking to anybody who's anywhere near us. They're available 24 hours, it's completely confidential. Nothing is reported back to us as an employer, but um, I have used these programs in the past and I can tell you they're very helpful. Um, if, if I, I know, especially today with mental health issues, therapists are hard to find. Um, this is a good first start. If, if anybody needs that or your families need it, all you have to do is mention Cerdoni and you have access to these programs. Mm -hmm. There's also a travel assistance piece to this, which is part of that employee assistance program. Um, and again, I have more information on that, but I also think it, we, we try to update all this information on our intranet as well. One of the other um, compensation factors we have is the flexible spending and dependent care accounts. So these are ways to allow you to put away tax-free dollars to help pay your deductibles, to help pay co-pays, um, over-the-counter expenses. Um, basically, you're saving your tax dollars on this, but it's, it can also help in kind of preparing for certain things. Um, some people have used it like if they know, say they're having a dental procedure coming up, they can put it off to January, put that money in their flexible spending account. It comes out over the year, but you could pay it up front and then um, get the reimbursement, pay it off, and then kind of schedule it a little, a little bit that way. 
Um, dependent care accounts work a little differently. They're for people with small children who, um, if you're paying camp fees, if you're paying daycare fees, it's basically to allow parents to work. These work a little differently. It is saving tax dollars as well, but you can only take out of the account what you've already put in. So um, with both of these accounts, it's a use it or lose it situation. You get um, 15 and a half months to spend it. Otherwise you lose what's in there. So you don't want to fund it too much if you don't think you're going to spend that, that money. But it is a good way to kind of help save some tax money and kind of prepare, especially for those deductibles. We also have an employee referral bonus of $1,000. Again, that's in red. So the specifics for that are in our handbook, but it's a nice little benefit. We, we feel that um, the best references we get to hire people are from the people who work here. We don't think anybody wants to bring in anybody that they would not want to work with or, or wouldn't think would do a good job. Um, obviously there are timelines, there are specific guidelines that need to be met, but we have paid it out in the past. And, um, especially when we're looking for challenging positions, we, and I, I know Noreen put it out there too, about our estimating coordinator position. If by chance, um, you have someone that you could recommend, just have those people mention your name as the referral on the application, or you could send their resume through you but that, that's a nice little feature we have as well. And then we have our retirement plan through Vanguard. So part of our retirement plan is we do have a company match. Um, everybody is matched 50% up to 6%. And then anybody who puts in more than 6%, you will be matched at 3% of your compensation up to the IRS max, which I believe is maybe 20,500 this year. Anybody over the age of 50 can do a catch-up contribution. We encourage everybody to use this plan. If you're not, you're leaving money on the table because you have, you're missing out on the company match. The nice thing about this plan is you're 100% vested from day one. A lot of companies, you have to wait five years to be fully vested, uh, but not with okay, I can imagine. I don't know yeah. why more employees don't utilize this. I mean, it's, it's especially the younger people. I mean- it's, you're, you'd you're be getting amazed. free money. <laughs> yes. And you'd be amazed at what that little bit you tuck away, every pay Absolutely. that you don't even miss. Believe me, after 31 years, you'd be you'd be surprised at how much money is actually in there. So Absolutely. Um, yep. It it does. And the longer you And you wait, don't miss it because you it's don't taken miss out it. automatically and you don't yep. miss it. Yeah. You know? And and the longer you wait, the the more or the less time you really have for that money to grow. So I encourage everybody even if, even if you just put the 6% in or 2%, right. whatever, start it, start it soon. Um, with that comes Joe Butcher, who is our fan, financial advisor. Um, so he can meet with you by phone. Um, we try to bring him in here every so often to schedule meetings for people who have questions, who, who don't really know what to do or where to invest. Um, I also recently sent out some educational webinars, seminars, and, and the conferences that Vanguard offers. I encourage you even just to check in with those, some of the target date funds, some of just the how to get started videos. Um, they're very helpful. And um, there's also LinkedIn Learning through our Project Pivot uh, module. There are tips about um, 401k savings, and retirement plans and, and how to plan. So um, just encourage everybody to, to do that. So that was it with um, insurance and compensation. Does anybody have any questions about that particular topic? Maria, I do. So mm -hmm. for the travel assistance, what's, mm -hmm. what's included in that? Well, that's with the Mutual of Omaha with the Employee Assistance Program. That I believe is something new. And honestly, I don't have the specifics on that memorized, but yeah. I can certainly share that information. I'm just curious, is it like for um, insurance for travel? I don't think it's insurance as much okay. as it might be, um, like if you're traveling abroad, if you need information on like visas and passports and yeah. that kind of thing. But I will look into that and I will follow up on that. All right. Thank you.
Any other questions? Okay, we'll go down to the benefits section. So as you can see, all of these are in red. So all of the details and specifics are within the handbook. Um, just to mention them, so maternity leave is four to six weeks. Parental leave is a new one that we started this year. So that's one week for um, people who are not covered by maternity leave. So if it's a spouse who has a child, if it's a, an adoption, a foster child, um, things of that nature, this one week is above and beyond PTO or anything like that. So it's really just a perk for parents to use to spend that time with your family when these situations occur. Jury duty leave. Um, I know from time to time we get people who get called for jury duty. Um, you are allowed up to 10 days of jury duty leave. Um, the stipulation with that is once you are released for the day, if you go in from eight, you're released at noon, you're supposed to come back to work. Um, some people never really use that 10 days. Some people use three days, four days, whatever, but this is your civic duty. So we like to encourage everybody to go. Um, I know it's not everybody's favorite, but, um, and you do not have to pay back what you get paid through jury duty, leave the pittance they give you. I, I know when I did jury duty and they sent me my $9 check, I wanted to give it back to them to buy a new chair for the next person to have to sit for so long, <laughs> something more comfortable. <laughs> but um, we do allow for that. Um, bereavement, depending on your loss, whether it be a spouse, a parent, um, another family member, you get either three days, one day, um, it's all written in the plan. So that is above and beyond any other paid leave. Paid holidays, we have 10. So we have the nine that are, are set. And then we have the one floating holiday. Um, PTO, we have, um, which is vacation and sick time combined. So that's one thing for people to keep in mind that I know a lot of people just see PTO as vacation. But um, what happens toward the end of the year, some people like to carry their time over. But keep in mind that, God forbid, if something happens and you need some sick time at the end of the year, that's your PTO time. So, um, but we revamped this a few years ago. We offered more, more days for people. And um, we've actually granted more days the more years you're here. So um, that's a nice benefit as well. Um, the Cerdoni Volunteer Program. So we're allowing employees to use up to 16 paid hours per year to volunteer within the community for company sponsored projects. Typically what we've done over the last few years because of COVID, um, most of this was the day of caring, which so many people participate in. And it's great because we get to choose what we'd like to participate in. Um, but then we also provide the garden, um, other collections, the flags. But um, if there is something that you're aware of, an organization that maybe the company would align with and would offer some type of volunteering opportunities, um, please bring them to our attention. You could bring them to me, you could bring them to Kim, um, just bring them to your manager. But um, it, one of our core values is community driven. So we like to encourage everybody to participate in this and give back. And then our fitness club reimbursement. So I had recently sent out the modifications to this. Um, we are now including family plans and spouse memberships. Prior to this, it was just employees. And we've increased the enrollment reimbursement to $600 per year. Um, so basically you're matched what you spend. If you only spend 400, you're only getting 400. But um, if you spend 600 or more, you'll get the 600 as long as you satisfy the number of visits per plan that are specified within the, um, the policy. I don't know if anybody has any questions about benefits. And again, um, refer back to the handbook. Um, I know many of you haven't looked at it since you joined, which could have been quite quite some time ago, but um, we do update it and we put the updates on the intranet. So please, um, that's your first stop to find out what we offer, if we offer it. And then um, if you have any questions going forward, obviously just reach out to me at any time. 
education. So we have a tuition reimbursement plan that is, is highlighted and detailed within our handbook. Um, we've also started our company paid training and certifications program, and, and we're really pushing that. Um, LinkedIn Learning is just one of those, but we've paired up with NEPERC. Um, we've started a subscription with um, the ACI for most of our field staff. Um, but if there are other things, um, please bring them to your manager's attention. We, we really want to invest in the progress of our employees and make sure that they're getting the training and education that they need to help do their jobs better. Um, the Wilkes University Education Partnership. So we, Cerdoni is part of the Family Business Alliance. And as such, we are granted tuition discounts at Wilkes. Um, previous to their update, basically you received the discount um, and it was, it couldn't be topped with any type of other incentive you get or the, uh, the merit award awards that your children would get or you as an employee would get, but now they've combined them. So if your child wants to go to Wilkes and they get say a merit award of a thousand dollars, then you'd also get, I believe it's 20% that we're able to get on this. And then for employees, if you wanted a graduate degree on your enrollment, you'd get a 10% discount. But I have more information on this as well. Um, and that's really it. We, we don't have any other colleges that we work closely with. Again, this is through the Family Business Alliance that we're getting that. So I don't know if there are any other questions about education. Okay, I'll move along to our perks. So um, our perks listing, we have our work from home one day per week. We instituted our summer hours this summer, which I think are going pretty well. Um, our on-site wellness checks and screening results reviews. So we just did the wellness screen, um, the blood draws last week. The screening results will be next week. I know that's always a favorite among people because not only do you not have to spend the time going to a lab to get these things done, you don't have to spend the money because these are deductible related expenses. Um, we'll also have the on-site on flu shot clinic again. That is scheduled for, I believe, October 5th, but we'll send more information on that. Um, tickets at Work. This is um, a website that we are a part of through the credit union and through Geisinger. And basically, you're offered exclusive discounts for all type of entertainment events, movie tickets, hotels, sporting events, theme parks. Um, I've tried using them in the past. Sometimes they're good deals. Sometimes they're not, but it's, it's a nice resource to use in case you're looking to save a couple dollars. We also are members of the UFCW credit union. So they are located. There's one near eighth street on Wyoming Avenue in Wyoming. There's one in Pittston. There's one in Hanover. There's one in Kingston. Um, the nice perks with this one, gift cards. So you could purchase Visa gift cards from them for a dollar. Um, if you were to purchase these cards at Price Chopper or Walmart or anything, they start at like $4.95 and go up. So for a dollar each, it's a good deal. Um, I'm not really sure what the Credit Union Rewards Program is. I know in the past it was if you refer people, you get, I don't know, $5 in your account or something like that. Um, but they do offer discounted movie tickets for Cinemark, discounted hockey tickets for Penguins games. And then they also partner with Enterprise Car Sales and Liberty Mutual Insurance for quotes. And Enterprise sometimes has their car sales when they're getting rid of their inventory. So um, they usually announce that information ahead of time. Our company cell phone plan is with Verizon. So we offer a Verizon discount for your personal plan. Basically, all you need to do if you do have that plan is tell them you're a Cerdoni employee. I don't even think you need to show them anything. In the past, I think you had to show a business card or something like that, but I don't, I don't think they really even care anymore. But um, it's a 22% discount except for billing. Now, I think this is just on service. So I don't think you get a 22% on phones and accessories. And obviously, there are 
so many layers of taxes, but it is, it is something um, that might be helpful. We also offer the Shield Gear store credit. So everybody gets the $50 gift certificate each year to purchase Shield Gear merchandise. Um, we open the store a few times a year. I'm guessing we'll be opening it up again in the fall. Is that correct, Maureen? Yeah, it should be opening up in September, the beginning of September. Okay, so if anybody still has them outstanding for this year, be, be sure to use them. Um, this was a nice addition to our perks when years passed, we never really had the avenue to buy what it is that you like and what fits you best and the colors and styles. So this, this has really been a popular perk as well. And employee lunches. Um, we like to celebrate things. We have our history lunches. We have appreciation lunches. We do, um, we try to do the Oktoberfest, different things like that. So, um, those, those are really the, the big perks that we have to mention that in case anybody wasn't really sure of or, or we haven't done a good job in communicating, this is, this is what we have listed for that. So any questions on perks or anything else really at this point? Maria, it's Jan, I have one. Hi Jan. Um, on that tickets at work, Mm -hmm. Were we ever told about this? Because it doesn't sound at all familiar. Yeah, we first got this through Geisinger. So this was when, and we used to have the flyer down on the bulletin board for it as well. So this is an old one. Um, but yeah, I think, um, I'm not sure that it's been well communicated over the years. And then once things get taken down from the bulletin board, <laughs> they kind of disappear. So um, what we've tried to do, and, and this was prior to COVID, and I know John could attest to this, when we were redoing our intranet, we were trying to put together a perks and benefits page on the intranet so that all employees can go and reference it and at least see what's out there and then ask questions. So um, this is something that I would like to put out there and update as, as needed. Okay, is there any information as to how to even get on the site or sign in or anything? You just like go to the website. You just go to the website, and um, which is listed there. Do and you then, need a company code? No, I don't believe so. No. Mm -mm. Nope. And so then I just went on that, Maria, mm -hmm. and I try and I and you have to put in your work email. Mm -hmm. And it's telling me this email address is not from an approved domain. Please use your company email address to sign up. Hmm. Okay. Let me look into that. And you used your company, you used your. Yes. And Hutchinson at Cerdoni. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I don't know why sure I spelled that. it right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll check into that then too. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. That should, that should work. Maria, it's Denise. Hi, Denise. Hi. Do you know if there's a specific number to check with for the Geisinger um, Healthy Rewards Program once the Healthy Rewards form has been submitted? Or should we just call like our Geisinger number on our card? Are you waiting for your check? Yes. And I, I know they probably take a while. They take a long time. Yeah, it's I've, been at least I've... a month. But, yes, I okay. think they tell you it's it's usually like eight to 10 weeks, I believe. Okay. Okay. So if you don't receive it in, in like another month, let me know. And then I'll just get in touch with our rep. Okay. But there is no phone number. They, it kind of goes into a bit of a black hole and then the check arrives. So yeah, right. they're, they're not really, um, they're not quick with it, okay. but you will get it. Yeah. Thanks. Hey, for the tickets at work on mm -hmm. the credit union page, mm -hmm. they have tickets at work and a code to put in. Oh, okay. So it's at the ufcwpa.org? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's a, I think it was through discount tickets or something like that, that you click on from their homepage. Okay. And then they have that on there. Okay. So yeah, so we can try that. I'll. I'll... Yeah, and it's a company code. So I don't know if that's different or if that's like a universal type of code. I'm not sure. 
I would assume it's a universal one, but I'll, I'll yeah. find out for sure and send out that information. Maria, is there, is there any update on the summer hours? Labor Day is three weeks away. Not yet, no. Okay. Nope. Any other questions? Okay. Well, thank you everybody. I will follow up with the information on the questions that you presented. And um, again, if you ever have any questions or concerns or need further explanations for things, just please give me a call or stop by. Thank, thank you. you. Thank Thanks you. everyone. Thanks, Maria. Thanks, Maria. Yeah.